Hello, this is Coach Andy. We're talking about uh, day 26, 365 chess master lessons. And the topic is a knee jerk, and uh, basically it's the reaction, right? So, some um, reflex, yes. Yeah, so, it's called in English, it's called reflex. So basically, yeah, here it's uh, the opening is the new uh, the color palm. Okay, so now let's go take a look. Let's um, okay, bring my mouse. E four, D six, D four, D five, knight jump, take take knight jump, and uh, this is a very old way to play that. Okay, now I think most people just do bishop f five attacking the knight, and uh, take take. So getting um so here after take yeah this is create uh capture towards the center but of course create a weakness on this e file that's a, a little bit of problem like uh, where the king should castle so um a lot of times you know, she should castle that side okay so now double pawn create a problem for this bishop how can he get out right. If you could take this way, so when we send problem double pawn, the baby cannot get out from here. So he had to get out from this way and castle the king side. King side. Okay, now take a look. Knight jump. Continue. Yeah. If you don't know how to do anything, just continue with your move. Now his knight cannot move. His bishop cannot move. So only he's can develop is this bishop. So get the bishop out. Bishop out. Attacking a pawn. Knight jump, yeah, so now two pieces getting out, castle, so white can castle. Um, maybe, but I think black should try to go here attacking right away. Forget about castle this side, you cannot castle this side. Let's come over and um, try to attack this way. Now what he did, he pushed pawn, that's um, kind of fine. Um, still it uh, takes time because after you have this kind of strategy yeah, you get a bishop out maybe but what's the purpose for you to get a bishop out right and um, why you want him out the king is staying in the middle okay so unless you want castle that side okay so maybe we should try to move the queen first then yeah like a move queen here we'll leave the pawns here there no danger because after pawn push then make this pawn weak okay so now let's see we we'll go back um just kind of play uh just uh it's, it's what's called it's a uh, i don't know the word <laughs> it's a uh, so basically it's trying to avoid this kick but um, that's fine uh, yeah, Fisher always did that, does that, okay, so, but here, yeah, this is two Czech players, okay, so now let's see, uh, <coughs> pawn b5, yeah, she's still going up, now we start attacking this kind of pawn stretch, I think pawn b5 is a big mistake in this game, okay, so this is a very small one, I'm not sure it's a mistake or not, but this definitely is a big mistake, after that, the king had to stay in the middle. But if you want to stay in the middle, you want your pawn structure more stable, right? You don't want to push those pawn up. So that's the one thing. Okay. Now after this push, then yeah, this had to stay. Okay, pawn push, knight jump. We take, he take. So far, it's fine. Then queen go here attacking pawn. Knight, uh, he protect the pawn. Now we push. Of course, the main idea is this is a pin. So yeah, so that's the problem. When the pawn, yeah, when the king stay in the middle, he gets in the pin. I will start attacking the pawn. And if you take me, I take. I will just try to get rid of pieces, right? Getting everything in because black is slow to get those two rook out. We will get tempo on this queen. Maybe on this pawn and um, everything, yeah. So something will happen. Okay, so now let's see. He jumping knight, blocking the queen attack, and uh, but this also gave away a pawn. Oh, but if you take, you take, you take, you will take this pawn. But again, the king is uh, 
kind of weak okay so now we jump in knight try to get that pawn okay so he take now we take the pawn now here the queen can obvious the queen cannot take this because this ping and we have this threats triple attack so as I said, because this pawn is all gone, so you cannot castle that side. You are even so you are ready legally. You can castle, but uh, nobody wants castle that side. Okay, so he was defending c7 square. Look c, look come over, and uh, now we start attacking the queen. Where can you go? Almost no place. You cannot leave. If you leave, yeah, you have to either stay on C file or go go forward. Okay, so because otherwise I am, I already have two pieces attack the knight. You need a two piece defend it. Now we go here. This set up a very powerful discover. Okay, how can you avoid that? Okay, going here is a quadruple attack. It's a check, double check. Okay, so there. If you take my queen. If you take my queen, I'll go here, check, you come up, this is mate. And uh, what else? Now, if you don't take my queen, I definitely can discover something, okay? So, doesn't matter how you make it. Um, it's very hard. I'm not sure what's the best move right now. It's uh, totally very hard. And um, black actually resigned. It's, okay. it's too late for him to move the bishop out. The king is dead, and uh, what can he do? Maybe he should go move king go up. Looks good. But simple thing we can do is do a check, right? Force him take, then do another knight check, get to the queen. That's that should be fine. Okay. And the king is already unstable. And uh, yeah. This should be fine. Okay, so black resign here. So basically, the lesson here is uh, I think it's a yeah, it's point is they, they gave a top in each jerk. Okay, basically, but I'm thinking like uh, as a black, um, before you settle down the king, don't try to open the center, right? He pushed the pawn, pushed the pawn, then make the cent make this part, queen side open. Okay, so after totally open, then your king will be a trouble in trouble in the middle. So that's the biggest problem. So he should not do that. If we not do that, maybe he, this game can, can move continue for a long time. And uh, after he, yeah, basically he just kill himself by killing the defense. Okay, so let's stop here and uh, I see you next time.